Hello, uh, Philip Risk, curator of Gardens and Grounds at the Hermitage Museum and Gardens. And uh, for the last couple days, I'm uh, the curator of Muddy Muck. Uh, this is our grotto fountain, and it's really more of a, a like a, uh, a dripping fountain. Uh, if I turned it on full blast, it, it, it would shoot 20 feet, but I usually keep it on very low and it just drips into a pool, a pool that I had no idea where the bottom of that pool was. Um, there was a lot, a lot of muck uh, in here. I don't know how long it had been since it had been last cleaned out, but I had uh, committed myself to, to draining this fountain and cleaning it and um, be better part of yesterday and a couple hours this morning uh, it took. We drained it with a pump, but um, once it got down really low, the pump kept getting clogged. I cleaned it, it clogged again. So we just ended up using buckets to uh, finish off the job. Uh, the buckets are put away mostly, um, uh, but this giant garbage can, uh, I was, when I was working by myself, I was dumping it in there, and then this morning I got some help and I was able to hand off the buckets and, um, and then finish it off. And so it's really, you know, uh, completely empty except for a very tiny, tiny, tiny bit of water. Um, some things that we learned, that I learned, uh, is uh, this is where the water uh, slowly drains out and eventually it comes, bubbles back up into a mock stream slash bog and and then if you go way 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 down um, there's a wooden plug attached to some copper um, plumbing down here I don't know how long this uh, how old this wooden plug is but it, it, it looks very old and um, I would really want to talk to somebody who really knows what they're doing before attempting to remove that so it's been fun it's been dirty I look clean now, but I had my chest waders on for a little while, um, and uh, that's it. That's our fountain and our grotto, and it should be a much clearer grotto this year.